whatever it does, no matter what is, I can't see it being worth it. It's, We can barely cast it in a controlled environment. Well, I'm sure it takes practice. Oh! Ba -ra -ba. Yeah, that's that's what it is. You do a semicircle from down to up. I, mean, I guess the key might be not to press any side buttons on your way down. Yeah, but. So. See, he keeps walking forward when I'm pressing up. Let me try that again. doesn't say how long to hold for holds, which is another dumb thing about that type. I held it for a really long time. Like an exaggeratedly long time. Like... Like that long. I see what this is holding means hold it forever. I guess I'll try out in a battle and see if it actually is amazing. So here's a game breaker. You can duplicate jewels as much as you want with it. Oh, it's one of the things. With the Sword Brothers? Yeah. Ooh, that's weird. I wonder why. It says, to get this glitch to work, you must have exactly one type of the jewel you wish to duplicate. After selling any more than one on the menu selected with the remaining jewel equipped to one of Alucard's equip slots, the player then exits the pause menu. Oh wait, does it see here? Um, performing Sword Brothers and then talking to the Master Librarian while the animation is still playing can cause the game can pause the game on the librarian's buy menu, oh. which is something that's normally impossible. So it's not that the spell So you try itself. to sell it, and then you move it into an equip slot, and you can't sell something you're equipping, and so it... So the spell itself isn't necessarily anything special. The spell permits you to pause while you're on a menu. And the other one is... that you can go outside of the map with. There's always a, that kind of a bug in this, in these games, to exit the map. But, you have to have your sword familiar's level at 90 or higher, so you're probably not interested in that. Yeah, I can't cast it. If there's an enemy nearby, so it's worthless. Get this trash out of my sight. Die. This is a, a spell, I guess. Good. You killed something somehow. <laughs> well, you're using a lot of spells of some sort. <laughs> Help! Bye. <laughs> By using this glitch, though, you can also get percentages as high as over 400%. Oh, yeah. Which is silly, because map breaking. And, yeah, and Dawn of Sorrow. Oh, I know it revolves around using a move that lets you step, do that sort of teleport stab. And another one to lie, like, so, uh, other specialty that allows you to solidify on the other side of and the And you wall. disable it in the middle, and you stay where you teleported to. Yeah, and then the game's like, what the hell is going on? Yep. In and this one, the, you can go to any square on the rectangles of the map, as long as you don't go out of the bounds, and it won't of crash. ruin, it somehow involves turning into an owl. But yeah, so, it's probably mostly stuff you're not interested in doing, because one of the things involves getting to level 90 on your... Sword, sword familiar, familiar I mean, alone. I might be able to do that. It depends on what kind of... If there's a CX that allows me to let level up while I'm not doing anything. 
unlikely. No, you never know. Not impossible, but unlikely. Like, maybe find a place with infinitely respawning enemies and just let it do its thing. But they, it would have to be acting fast enough for them not to hit you and kill you while you're away. Right, or can I just do that while I'm doing something else and occasionally go to heal because everything does one damage to me. I spell myself and my controller. The demon doesn't seem to care to follow me. Here come old flat top. <laughs> he he grooming up slowly. And not very well. <laughs> he won Juju Eyeball. He won Holy Roller. He got Juju Eyeball. That's what it is. Nobody won Juju Eyeball. <laughs> he have feet down below his knees. Nope. He doesn't? Nope. What's he have then? Eyeballs. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good. Um, so yeah, let's go fight Captain America. Belmont. Holy glasses. <laughs> there really has to be a... Can you call it like spectacles or something? It's holy glasses. It just sounds silly. You really wanted to do that by just jumping, didn't you? Oops. Yeah, it takes over this Wait, where's what? those parts on the map you didn't get yet? Oh. Oh. I've been waiting for you. Okay. Answer me. Why is the Belmont planning the resurrection of Count Dracula? Count Dracula rises but once every century, and my role is over. If I can resurrect him, then the battle will last for eternity. If those are your true feelings, then so be it. Did you say oompa? He said holy cross, and then he said yumta. <laughs> Stop! I'm trying to break a ball. Oh, you have to attack that. Yeah. You, if you beat him, you do the bad ending. If you yeah. beat the ball, you do the good ending. You killed me! The resurrection of Count Dracula is at hand. Shaft, you died in the previous game. Richter killed you like, twice, I think. But yeah, so you can still get the bad ending if you accidentally kill him while trying yes. to do that. Yes, if you kill Richter, and now this now for something completely different that makes perfect sense. Ah, PS2 era cinematics, and PS1. Oh God, it's an upside down castle from space, or from the sky at the very least. She have summoned an evil, up, an even more evil, upside down castle. How could he? The fiend. He summoned an anti castle. Um, huh? Is that bad? I don't know. No. What the I hell? Thank you, Alucard, for saving Richter. Why could you could have done that? Alucard, the same Alucard who fought alongside my ancestor. Belmont. Ralph Belmont, thank you. <laughs> in, Japan, in Japan, his name was Ralph. But they changed it to Trevor in English? Yes. Why? Because Ralph, I guess, doesn't sound pass enough. Take Richter and leave here. I'll finish this. Alright. Good luck. He's gonna kill his own daddy. He's done it before, potentially. Whee! It's like that thing on the top of the Sky Tower in Sonic and Knuckles. Pokemon. In the Sky Sanctuary. Yeah. Yes, this is literally the other castle, but upside down. Yeah, and there's some other enemies. That's about it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Even the fire is upside down. And it burns down. We, we can fight upside down Dracula here, you'd think. 
I'm gonna fight upside down Dracula. <laughs> that actually sounds pretty easy. Upside down chandelier. Here, have a zircon. Oh, here's that secret passage from earlier. It's already open, though. Help! Here's Dracula's good storage. Oh, royal cloak. Take off those glasses. They look silly on you. This is definitely an upgrade. Oh, yeah. Let's see how it looks. It's blue. It's not as cool as being transparent. No. But, change but it's it. but it's better for you. We, have, we can be a blue and green back now. Yeah, which makes you kind of look like a mech, honestly. Oh, uh, yes! If a mech could transform into a bat, yes! I mean, I don't or see if why it was a bat-themed mech. Like a zoid or something? Yeah. Bastard zoid. That sword does not have a father. It probably is not very good. You already had one, I thought. No, it is... This is <laughs> It still does four damage less than the dagger. <laughs> I love its description. It's a sword. <laughs> no special animation. It's just a regular sword. We have all these fancy things in... Sword. You could put it in a sword. Bork. You could ford a whole board. Multiple times. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> it did look like he just bonked his head on it. So that's what he actually does. Yeah, he bonks his head. It must have to do with how much distance there is before you can flip. He really does not seem to mind bonking his head. No, I don't need the cross. Wait, so he's to fall into the sky now? Oh, oh, oh. Hey, it's Yorick! Yorick, what are you doing? Oh yeah, he's he's the last guy that can drop the skull shield. Yorick, what are you doing up in the... Not the, the weird... Chasing place. his own head around? How did you get here? Resist the fire. same way that Desmond the Moon Bear made it to the moon. But how? The end. <laughs> I was gonna say, the answer is the end! Oh, I don't know if you destroy his head, he like freaks out. Well, wouldn't you freak out if you're a skeleton and someone broke your head? But how, I'm not sure if I would know. Whoa! I do diagonals! Wouldn't you freak out if someone destroyed your head? I mean, I don't think you'd do anything, on it. Upside down library card! I think it takes you to the regular library. Yeah, the other library doesn't have a librarian in it. Upside down save rooms! I'm glad that the D20 comes down here for me. Well, that's it for today. You stayed almost exactly to the time. Uh, I'm off tomorrow, and... What is today, Thursday? When Wednesday. Okay, then yeah, I'm off tomorrow, and then the other days I'm on the convention. Uh, not tomorrow, I don't think. Well, I'm gonna throw bagels at you then. Oh, that's my wallet. Don't throw your wallet at my butt. <laughs> your butt appreciates it. Though. That's not the truth. <laughs> anyway, that is all. Thank you guys no, for no, watching. Tails' butt does not like money. This is gonna be a really bad video to cut because it is seven hours long. Really? Yes. There's no way that can be right. Seven hours and ten minutes and counting. Damn. Anyway, thank well, you guys for watching. We are well over halfway through the game. Yes. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good day. The Upside Down Castle is shorter. Even though it's the same size. Noon, morning, whatever it is where you are. We'll see you again real soon. Put, put. And take care. Bye-bye.